はい。カバンを2つと、とも2つと、粘りは、ガラクタ。ガラクタを避けて、部屋をすっきり、スウェーデン、クモの、数を払いながら、狭い階段を登っていた。いい、あん、ひ、ともわたす。Uh, he watatsu. He watatsu, hi. He watatsu, the futatsu tomo. So both, both of the things. Hi. So he handed, he hand over, he watatsu, the kaban. And then afterwards, to, immediately. Nebari wa, nebari, he, yoket. The uh, he suki he um, yokete garakutao garakutao yokete the garakuta is junk. He yoketed junk. What is it? Yoketed is a yoketed. is to avoid or to dodge. He dodged. He dodged the junks. And then he tsukiri the heya, so he crosses the room. Right. Uh, tsuai with the king, he uh, kumono suo harai nagara while he was um, pushing aside or the um, spider web with the king, uh, he nobote the kaidan, so he. He climbed the stairs. Perfect. The narrow. And what kind of stairs? Semi. Ita, meaning he. Uh, away from the current position. Right. Um, Ichidan. Joga, or is it Wega? Mm. It is agaru, the verb. Agaru. But yoga uh, was a good guess. Ni. Hi. Uh, tabi ni is... Hmm. You know what ichido means? That's... Ichido means one, one time. Hi. So tabi... Is this one kanji on itself? So without an iti modifying it, instead we're modifying with agaru, agaru tabi. Ah, so ichidan agaru tabi ni. Whenever he go up one stair, right. hokori ga mai agaru. The dust it dance up. It flies up. Hi. Um, the my dance is a fluttery kind of dance versus like, I don't know, like a ballroom dance or something. It just, so it has like a fluttering kind of idea with it. So when dust is dancing in a fluttery like way, it's just like how you measure what happens when dust floats up. It just kind of has that like a poof, basically. Hi. And Mani, that agaru that comes with my agaru is the same as the ichidan agaru, Hi. just without the kanji. Yes. 
a lot of times with the compound oh. verbs in the book, the second verb doesn't get the 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 kanji. Hi. So then um next it's a uh, next one said um or wa the net to is ni I together with Bennett no Kori no ko sarita was left behind. Perfect. Why do you have no koso here rather than no koru? No kosaru is the cause. We were we were left behind by Neburi. Hi, exactly. We we did we did, um we wasn't just incidentally left behind. It was something so, that causes the um but netto wa chibun no this is ka mo ka nang motu or is it ka motu? It does end with motu, but it's ni motu. Ni ni motu. Chibun no ni motu o mate. It's not mate, it's mote. Mote nebari no. Uh, ato uh, otte iku. So Bennett by him, uh, he take his belonging, his things. Uh, he 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 take his things and he chase after. Uh, nobody. Hi. Away from I, Hi, and do you know why this? Te does not have a comma, just like how this te earlier did not have a comma. We have two verbs in one clause, but on, but no comma after the te. So I'm guessing the, the subject of the verb is the same, but net though. That's true. In general, this means these two actions happened at the same time. But net was carrying the bag and chasing after nobody. And over here, nobody was crossing the room and dodging the lu the luggage. The idea is that he's doing both act both actions at the same time. He couldn't cross the room without dodging the luggage, and he couldn't have chased he couldn't have been chasing after nobody if he wasn't carrying the luggage with him. Well, when there's a comma, that tends to insinuate this happens first, and when that's done, we start the next action. And we start that tends to be how it um works. So here it's a Oremo Oremo Suite Iko to Sitaga Beneto Ga Kaida O Sita De Tachi Domate Oreno Ho o furi mui da no de te no o do ka nai ba sho e ho ato zu sata sata zu sata ore mo suite iko I also follow. Otosuru? Iko to shita. Iko to shiru mean. This is the volitional form of iku. So iko. And then to shiru is I make an attempt to follow. Yep. Yeah, perfect. However, However Benetto ga kaidan no ue kaidan no shita de at the at the beneath or right beneath the stairway tachi domatte he come to a standing stop. 
he he was at a stand a standstill. Right. And ore no ho o furi mui pano de. So he he furi mui ta. What did he do into my direction? He uh. Hey, this he turned. muita comes. He, yep. He sh I, but this turning is just the turning of the head, not of the whole body. Just the. It neck. could be the whole body, but um, furikairu tends to just insinuate the head, but it, it just means to turn towards. Right. So he turns, he furi muita towards my direction therefore no there te no doko te no to do kanai ba sho e to atto su atto su satta atto zatta is to retreat you have to use to context retreat. to know who's te, who's retreating, um, things like that. You have to guess by context rather than grammar. Hi. So here it's a te no to to do kanai. Do kanai is to do ku in the negative tense. So. Todoku is to what is it? Todoku is to to arrive. To punch to hit. Todoku is to arrive. Um, for example, if todoku. you have a lunchbox that you want to deliver to your dad, you todoku your lunchbox. You go to where the dad is and you give him the lunchbox. So that was a really random thing. I just, <laughs> different book I was reading said that. Um. It just so means to go, arrive the... at a location. It goes somewhere. Hi. Um, the place which the hand could not arrive. Hi. La shoe. Towards. Eh, towards. Hi. To here marks. Uh, quoting particle. That particular That's a place. really good guess. However, eh. Um, is being modified by to, kind of like wa, basically. You don't really say ewa. That's that's not something that people say. So you can say eto instead. Um, as like the Hi. stress modifier type of thing. Hi. Right, so Khan here is saying that he is retreated from that place, right. which no, the hand could place. not arrive. Oh, towards it, eh, basho eh, towards it. He and retreated he to the that? place where and could not arrive because no be because um oreno ho o furi muita he turned towards my direction. Therefore, right. I retreat to the place where his hand could not arrive. Perfect. In other words, his hand could not. Reach. Hi. Um, that's probably how I would say it in English. Baneto wa garakuta, and we just saw that verb garakuta just now. It is a noun in a previous sentence. You're right. It was right over here. Garakuta o yokete. Junks. Hi. Stuff. Garakuta darake no heya o yubi sashita. So Bennett points fingers, point his finger at the room where the junk is doing what? The junk is parake. Darake. Or darak, which is darak is also not a verb. So we have no verbs here since the no. Garaku da darake. 
Darake is a lot like ipai, but is um I'd say negative connotation. Um, so garakuda darake means full of garbage. So the room full of garbage. The room that is of full garbage. He right. points the fingers. And he say shoji clean. Shoji. Hi, hi, wakari masta yo. He say I know already in a whining sense. But netto wa kaidan o nobotte ita. But net climbs the stair away from Khan. Perfect. Ita. Gara. Kuta again rubbish stuff. Garakuta no yama o mima washita. So mima and then wa wasu is to look across or to survey Hi. the mountains, but here this mountain mean like a mount of junk. Hi. Mound, so he surveyed the, the the mound of junks, and he sat sato, which mean quickly, but not quickly in that sense, but um, Hi. briefly, I'm guessing sasato. Uh, sasato basically means uh immediately, like you didn't like you didn't dawdle to start the next activity. Right no away, dawdling. immediately. Hori kakata hoga yosasoda. Some hard vocabulary here. Tori is to is from toru Hai, to hold. To, take. to hold is um is mosu. To hold is mosu. This here is to take. Hai. So. Take and then kakaru or kakata to take and hang. To take and to then take I'd say begin tends to be kakaru's um meaning in verbs like hanash kakeru. <laughs> so kakaru and kakeru are the same verb. Um, it's just one takes all and one takes ga. Um, so it, it just tends to have like a beginning meaning to it. So to take a begin though, this is kind of weird for the meaning. It means to start, to commence. To commence. Tori kakata is to commence. Right. What is he commencing? Hoga yosaso da. Ho is this the direction. Ho can mean direction. That is correct. For example, ore no ho, which was over here somewhere in this sentence when nobody furimukud. Um, however, this is the second meaning of ho, which is actually related to the direction word, just like yori is related to the word um, from. So um, they are, there is that connection between the two words. It is the same word right here, ore no ho. However, we would not translate in English this whole as the direction of Torikakaru. Instead, we translate it with the more meaning. Just like if that said yori in that context, we translate it with the less meaning rather than the from meaning. Hoga yosaso, meaning. Yo e within which mean good, right. but this is the causative. So that's a really good sasaru. guess. However, yo e is a adjective, and um, guessing it's e plus sudu is another good guess. But then you'd have to turn e into a adverb like yoku, like stuff like that, which doesn't really do that to mean good normally. This so right here is the na adjective so, hence marked by the da character down here that's how we know it's so this ne rather than like shimashou because you wouldn't say suruda that's actually grammatically incorrect verbs do not um connect to da 
you have to put a filler between them, like no. Like you say, oi kakete iku da, not correct. Oi kakete iku no da, fine. Oi kakete iku koto da, something like that. You need to have some kind of filler between the copula da and verbs. So you know for a fact, because there's a da here, that this can't be a verb. This has to be either a noun or a na adjective because it's ending in da. So solda um, is the um, thing that means um, looks like. And it's being used here to basically mean this is what I should do. It sounds good is what we say in English, which is weird as well. Sounds good, right? So here it's literally looks good. Which is yo sa so yo yes yo yo sa so does come from yo yoi. Um, I'm not sure exactly where the sa came from, but e is a irregular verb. Um, but uh, it it is e. Uh, I'm not grammatically sure where the sa comes from. Sorry, but it it's the same as it. Literally, it looks good, but it means like the English sounds good. So what Hi. sounds good? So. All together, this sentence say, start right away, uh, commence is good. So it's yeah. good to start right away. Exactly. Perfect. It seems good to start right away. Mazu, firstly, mazu wa hako sono Uh, first, we will take outside the 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 box, the hako, and then after that. So no ato, the old chairs and table. Perfect. Uh, then the following clause says sukaeru mono to. The thing that are use usable. The thing that are of use. Sukaeru. Uh, we are. Uh. The thing that I've used uh, together with suteru shikanai mono, the thing that cannot be thrown away. Right. Um, good guess. So, what does shika mean? Only, only. So, the thing that is shikanai, meaning nothing but. So nothing but to throw away. So the thing that of no use, no use. Suteru shikanai mean of no use. Right. Um, mono. Wait, but this is weird. Why did he say the thing of use and the thing of no use? Well, because the oh, verb is wakeyo. wakeyo. That's why you have to read the whole Hai. sentence. Things don't make sense when you don't got a verb. <laughs> Hi. He say sort them out. Wake yo. Separate the sukaeru mono, the thing of use. Okay. And I'm the suteru shikana mono. The thing that nothing but to throw away. And yeah, I so hate he, that word shikanai. Shikanai. It's a lot you find shika a lot easier for some reason when it's the not the verb adu. When there's a different verb, you never really struggle with it. So it's interesting that adu really messes you up. I think it's because in general, adu and nai tends to mess you up. You tend to forget that nai is just a negative form of adu, just like how, um, I don't know, like wakarimasu, the, the, wakaru, the opposite of that is wakaranai. I think that tends to be where your confusion comes from. Um, and you think it says nai, but like nothing. But it's Nai as in not to exist. I, um, but uh, what does this te mean? We got dashte with a comma. What is that comma telling us? 
a comma is saying is sequential. So first, so, so. this, then that. Exactly. So you see how that comma is very useful for knowing the difference between the motte and the oikakete kuru in this sentence, being like, oh, same time, different times. Um, Got to carry stuff out before he divides things. Perfect, perfect. はい。さっそく木箱の鎖かけた蓋を開けた瞬間。粘りが弟子の俺にこの仕事を明かせ明かせたわけがわかった。Firstly, uh, sasoku money. What is this? Same meaning as mean? sasato. It means right, right away, promptly. No, no pause. Hi, Sasoku. Kibako no kusari kaketa futa o. So futa is the lid. Hi. Of the lid, the lid of the barrel. So the lid that is rotting away, the kusari kaketa. Is anything else possibly rotting? Or being the specific thing we're specifically saying is rotting? I'm sorry, no. Is the lid of the barrel of rottings? Hey, so barrel is taru. I do know you know what kibaku means. I think you just uh, are having it stuck in your brain. But it's wooden box behind the rotted, the lid of the rotting wooden box. So the rotted wooden box. So the lid's probably rotted. That'd be a logical assumption to make, but literally it's just saying the box is rotted that the lid is attached to. Who knows? Maybe it's a metal lid. Probably not. It's The lid's probably lid. <laughs> rotted. So what happened? What is this shunkan? Oh, the box that is rotten, the lid of the box that is rotten, Aketa, Aketa Shukan. What is Shukan? Shukan is the space. Hi, hi, the hi. This is the moment. Is... The moment. The moment. Right. And then Akeru is to open the moment. When I open the lid of the rotten box, nobody got he, he, what did he do? He, he uh, makasetad. Makaseta. Makaset. What does that mean? Makaseru is to leave to someone. Yeah, like to leave a job to someone, like oh. a shigoto. Hey. He left. What? And but it modified wake ga wakata. He's saying right. now I understand the reason. No, he say I understand the reason which this job was handed to me. Perfect. Shigoto o makata. Um. Uh, de shi no ore ni, I, the apprentice, kono shigoto, this particular job was handed to me. Now I understand the reason for it. Perfect. The and out of curiosity, opened... what do you think wake ga nai means? You translated that perfect. Okay, ga nai. I'm just making you practice nai. <laughs> wake ga nai meaning there is no reason. Yes, nai there is, is no the reason. opposite of out Hi. And once you get that down, I think you'll have an easier time with those type of things. So I'll stop sharing. I'll see you in five seconds. <laughs>